Okay, so this is Angelic Ruins. Uh, it is a really wide open area, uh, reminiscent of the Descent and uh, the Iridian Promontory. Promontory. That I never know how to pronounce that properly. It's the last gauntlet before the final boss. Uh, and I died almost. <laughs> Luckily, that guy was there, and I am able to kill him. Uh, that would have been bad if I died right away. Uh, so basically, if you're coming here from Hellbarbia, you already know this, but every round has the same waves. Uh, same set of five waves. It's The first one is a starter wave, just some generic uh, people, no, the bandits. And I shot the speaker, because I thought it was shooting me. <laughs> Uh, yeah, there are basically going to be some bandits here, and, uh, I don't know if there's any skags in this map, because I didn't see anyone, any of them. I didn't do, go that far into this, I just did the first round and left it. Uh, here's, okay, it looks like there's two guys left. Uh, I don't really actually like this map. I think this is probably one of the more difficult ones to deal with because it is really wide open and uh, the guys in the arenas are probably really like I think they are uh, programmed to shoot more accurately because I noticed I was dying a lot faster than I was not while going through like even the lance weren't as annoying as some of these even these bandits were uh, the second round is the or second wave sorry is the gun wave which is basically just a bunch of people with guns uh, bandits, lance, bull uh, brutes, etc, etc. Oh, I guess they're called bullies in this. And I decided... To oh yeah, I changed up my guns for this round from what I had. I went and grabbed my primal masher, which is the uh, revolver... Uh, revolver shotgun, basically. Uh, and I went and switched up my SMG to my times 4 double anarchy. I think it has like 95 times 4 damage. Uh, I did that because of the, uh, I died on the Horde wave in the first round of the, uh, of the, my first attempt on Hell Burbia, and, uh, I determined that my SMG was, uh, going to be a big factor, because my machine gun wasn't doing too much damage, being caustic and everything. And I am proud of that. I went and lit him on fire in mid-air. <laughs> uh, and I'm being killed from somewhere. See what I mean? It's kind of hard to see where everything is, and uh, it, you're pretty much shot from everywhere, and it's kind of annoying, in my opinion. Um. I am amused by her. <laughs> She's quite humorous to listen to while you're playing. Oh, she is still up there. I didn't actually notice that. Oh, and here comes the Horde Wave, which is all psychos, all the time, and it's quite annoying. At least, these were all lunatics right away. Ah, they threw an axe at me! No, how could you throw an axe at me? Why? Why? Um, this area is a lot better for the Horde Wave than it is for every other wave, just because, of course, you're lots of open space to run away from them. Uh, this map is really good for the Horde Wave. That's all I'm going to say. The Horde Wave isn't really that big of a deal. Like on other maps. Like Alberbia, where I died. Yay. Uh, and just for measure, boom headshot. Wave completed. <laughs> uh, I did not get hit once in that round. That wave, sorry. I'm going to be saying round instead of wave a lot. Anyways, next wave is the second to last. Wave 4 is the badass wave. It's basically a couple of minions with a badass. So that was the minion and apparently there was two... There's a bunch of guardians here. Interesting. I'm guessing the Guardians are considered badasses. Maybe the Arc Guardian is the badass of the Guardians. I never really could tell. I knew there was badass Guardians. I'm not sure why they didn't throw one in there. 
unless it's one of the other ones that were off to the side and died before I actually got to them. Or, no, wait, I sniped them, I think. We'll find out now. Oh, there's a dude there, and he's running off. Lance Commando. So, there was Lance with me. How nice. So yeah, the badass wave isn't too too bad in my opinion. There's less guys, but they're more powerful. And I'm being attacked from the side. No, oh, it's Sentinel. I don't like the defenders. I I really hate the defenders. They're my least favorite character or enemy in this entire game, in my opinion. Even worse than Mo and Marley. And I really don't like Mo and Marley. <laughs> uh Health pickups. Okay. And then the last wave, I'm looking for the stand for it, but uh, is the boss wave. Let's meet our next boss. All the way from the dig site, it's Baron Flint. And I get to fight Baron Flint and his boomstick, which I don't think he actually has because it's not the same as what I used before. I think he's got one of those. It shoots rockets! Shotguns. Because I noticed it was full, firing one bullet, and you'll see that plenty of during this little soiree. And I have to, still have to say, I love the boss, the little techno boss battle beat they came up with for the boss fights here. And I kill him with a couple of headshots, and I go after Flint and set him on fire. It's still got the 600% burst fire rate count, but I think it's uh, one of those fires one shot. It's a rocket thing. Um, so yes, I am basically just going to kill... Oh yeah, I got lucky here and he didn't die and burned to death. And that should be just about it. I think I just back up here and I start sniping him, because that's a good tactic in this area because his gun isn't very accurate. <laughs> There's a tip for ya. Oh, um, uh, I did fight Sledge in one of the other maps, and uh, sniping him was quite easy. <laughs> I think that was in one of my Hellburbia runs. I did. I went a little bit further in Hellburbia than I did in these other two maps. Uh, Okay, yeah, there's nothing else to say here. <laughs> Just killing Baron Flint again. Just like old times. And he's dead, and now I have to go kill that one last guy, and he, if he killed me, it'd be hilarious. But, no. And that is it, and there's your stand for the three guns you get. Huzzah! Anyways, back to the menu here. So go ahead and click whatever one you want. I do the gully after this one, because it is number three in the list of of things to click. <laughs> uh, so yeah, Hellberbia is still there, Angelic Ruins, the gully, etc, etc. Same crap different pile <laughs> go ahead have fun click one click click if you click the angelic ruins that'd be funny <laughs> go and reload the map I'm gonna set up that annotation it's there it's there you can click it it will restart and reload this same screen go ahead click it <laughs> okay click one have fun <laughs> 